Solid FPS here, and in this video I'll be covering the best way to get silver in Skull and Bones. You should have finished the story by now and done the helm quest to unlock the hideout. In the hideout, we have to go to the supply network and pick up every liaison quest. These quests are very easy and give us a ton of helm materials. They also say they are daily, but everything in here is actually hourly, so remember to do these every hour. Next, fast travel up to the targets and kill one of the helm merchants. This will complete all the trade quests out here and fill up your ship with helm materials. Go back to the island and drop everything off in your warehouse. Then go to the other outpost and turn in your other trade quests for more helm materials. With all these materials, now we gotta refine them all at the hideout. Travel to both of your hideouts and refine everything at the distillery and laboratory. As you make more pieces of eight, or as I call it, gold, you can invest them into the smuggler operations upgrades at the hideout table. They do say they reset at the end of the season, but I think this timer is bugged since the season hasn't started yet. With how easy it is to earn gold in this game, I wouldn't worry about this. This entire category of upgrades boosts production and will eventually allow you to turn your basic purple products into higher tier ones that are worth a lot more. Move all the rum and gin you don't need and move it to your ship's cargo, then go talk to Skurlock. On the left you can see the silver price you get for each product that you make. I'm also carrying some opium and snuff so you can see that it's not worth selling it to him. The same goes for all your opium and snuff over at the other kingpin. Move all your opium and snuff into your ship's cargo, then go talk to Rama. On the left you can see that the price is flipped, you get maximum profit for opium and snuff, but half for rum and gin. And there you have it, the best and most consistent way to make tons of silver in the Skull and Bones endgame.